Yeah, we, let's just do it. What the hell? That's fine. If we can unlock the perk for that, it already does three times the amount of normal damage for uh, crit shots, like headshots and stuff. But if we unlock the exclusive, it's two times more damage on top of what damage it is already multiplied by. So we're talking a lot of damage. Okay, this connects back here. We're not even gonna bother selling the Velvet Blue right now. Someone helped me recover a stolen jewel snatched by a thieving crow. I bet it can be found in the vile thing's nest. It is an heirloom of our family and cannot become some bird's plaything. We get three spindles. That detestable Ramon Salazar. Even the very sight of his image it makes my skin crawl. Do me a service and find some way to deface the portrait of him in the room shown in the photograph, will you? I'm not particular about how you do it. Hitting it with something might do the trick. See attached photograph. So deface the portrait of him in this area. And we got four spindles. Okay. Oh, nothing but we will uh, we'll figure something out. Oh my god. Hopefully this isn't a fighting sequence. Open my old water real quick. Hang in there, Ashley. <laughs> Another velvet blue. Anything to pick up? No. A spittle, though. Not bad. Getting quite a few of those things. This is okay. This is almost full. We'll just reload this all the way just because we can. Salazar, you are nothing if not unyielding. I was not expecting to see him so soon. However, I'm afraid he didn't see you. How did he know it's that I was coming? This intruder. Okay, where are the archers? Let's fall back. <clears throat> Pardon me. Where are these archers? Well, if you're not going to make a move. Flanking. Not yet, at least. You're all just kind of like huddled over there for some reason. Out of the way. 
All right, that'll do it. Um, let's see. There's a barrel over here. Secret? Secret. Gold bar. Okay, we can sell that for good money. Resources. There's one of these things. I'm pretty sure we've only missed one of those those wind up things. Okay. This is the same area. I thought it was different, but it's not. Some gunpowder. Okay, we're making our way up. See if we can get an angle to pick up, pick up some of these guys that are up ahead, because I definitely hear them. I don't see them though. far up this goes or where I should be looking I'm just like picking off the individuals that I can't see oh my god okay interesting That, that was actually a really cool mechanic. I was not expecting that. Okay, no one's flanking. It definitely sounds like they're trying to come from behind, but that that's just that's what's this guy? Being too close. wonder if we left that intact would we have been able to like gain access to some kind of treasure hmm I don't know all right see some movement over there I don't want to... Yeah, I'm not going to waste a, a rifle shot. <clears throat> I don't think I have to. Previous legs. What's this? A massive boulder, okay.
Okay, and this actually destroyed the barricade that was here. That's cool. There, oh, there are indefinite balls. So if we hug this, are we still going to get hit by the ball? Okay. Try and bait this guy out. I don't think it worked. Did you not get grabbed? Or, uh, how did you not get hit? That's what I tried to say. Must have missed it with our first headshot. Because that's actually ridiculous. That guy is like a face of steel. Oh my goodness. Okay. Reload this just because we have more ammo to do so. And we are in fine shape. Keep on going. Sorry, must have slipped. Well, balls. I don't know where all these people came from. That's okay, though. Even more up ahead. Okay. That's impressive. Definitely need to heal. Mirror with pearls and rubies. If I knew where all these guys were, I would actually load these barrels up from down here. I do not know where they are, however. Oh. So you can parry that with your knife. You, you can parry it. That was just really bad. What? Uh, how was I not able to parry that? You can parry quite a few things with a knife. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, is this never ending? Oh, 
Somos tu patrullo. Que nos... That's unfortunate. Okay, so this is much like other areas of the game where I pretty much got bottled down. And uh, limited myself to one area, which was a massive mistake. I should have actually shifted my position. I have a feeling that I am not going to be able to use these explosive barrels to my advantage now because all the people are dead already. Okay, we got the extravagant clock. How do we get further up? Do I have to pull this button? <laughs> I think I do. A lift. How thoughtful. I thought that guy died in three shots. That's actually like intense. Okay. So I'm actually kind of curious how many shots from a sniper that thing can take because we hit him with three shots of the chest. And that was not able to kill him. That was pretty cool. I was not expecting that. All right, let's try this again. How thoughtful. Actually, I have an idea. Okay, let's go for this. Need to drop some weight. Oh no. Okay. Well, the key is not to allow those things to actually jump on the platform. Uh, we don't have a lot of handgun ammo. We actually don't have a lot of any ammo. I was not expecting this fight, so let's see what we could do. Get some more rifle. Can we mix more handgun as well? No, we can. Okay. Uh, we need to use at least one, so we're in better shape. Okay. A lift. How thoughtful. I'm closer, so I have a better shot on you. Oh, no. How 
did that miss? Where is this guy going? Oh, fuck. Yeah, definitely can't let that guy run away. Like, reposition and have to make sure that we take care of him before he decides to do that. Um, maybe keep the, ski the scope on for that part, just so it's easier to see. We have to heal, too. Thoughtful. Should be right there. What? Fuck. Don't give up, dude. No mess around with that thing. Shit. Uh, let's see. Take the scope off that. Oh, shit. Need to drop some Another one? Oh my god. How did that miss? This is a damn shotgun, dude. Okay. Got some hand gun ammo. We have the red nine, actually. So we killed some of those red, uh, those red cloaked folks down there. Can we actually go down and, like, loot their bodies? Um, we are pretty low on health. I don't want to heal. Call me crazy. Really don't want to. But I kind of think that we're not remotely close to the end of this chapter. So, should probably heal. I think that was my last one. Indeed. Oh, so our means of offense right now is definitely going to be the bolt thrower. 
Why is this yellow? Can we jump? Oh, we use our binoculars. It's Salazar. And it's Ashley. Do we have to walk slowly across this? I don't know. I don't know why I staggered like that. Oh, okay. People are shooting me. That's always fun. Yep. You do have to walk slowly across that. Walking slowly confirmed. So good. Nope. That son of dick. Ashley. We kill all those crows. How do we? How do we actually loot the crows? Can we get like super far ranged combat? No. The bolt thrower actually doesn't reach that far. You dick. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I just like completely whiffed on either side of the guy too. Oh, that was good. Okay, so we can go up here. We uh, we just used our green herb. We just used it and we just picked up a, a yellow herb. Welcome. What can I interest you in? Thank you. I actually think that we're going to sell that. Repair the body Without armor. The Definitely. Deserves, mate. And we're probably going to have to buy the first aid spray. Because things are looking... You get some bang for your buck. I get things aren't looking too good right now. I'm, I'm going to be completely honest. Well, then. Might want to take care of any leftover errands before... You said that last time. Crafts. Craft some handgun. To live the rest of your life what if? Am I right? Well, that's exactly what I want to happen. How come these guys aren't dying? Oh my god. Okay. Fifteen handgun rounds and uh what like five bolt casters? It's gonna clean everything up. 
Gonna clean up these archer dudes. Just you wait. Alright. So we did that. If we go up there, we can get some more resources. Let's see what's up here. Gun rhymes with fun for a reason, stranger. <laughs> oh, wow. It's actually really good that we didn't use 10 grand to buy that first aid spray because we literally just found one. Holy heck. Okay. Craft. Use. Hmm. Well, that definitely takes care of our health problem, but what about our ammo problem? Need more bullets. We jump down here. Got some more resources. Definitely get more handgun for sure. Um, that's not good. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah, that's not good at all. Looks like we're just going to be using the uh, the two handguns that we have. That's not good at all. If we have to fight Salazar right now, that's that's not good. Do tell our lord to not forget the loyalty of his servant, Ramon. <laughs> Ashley! Leanne. Such a fool, Mr. Kennedy. To have been bestowed with Lord Sattler's... You talk too much. You failed! <laughs> You vulgar, utterly uncivilized! Ah! Oh my god. that What I'm what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to zone this man out from uh, being able to hit me. I'm trying to like always stand behind like some sort of like cover or wall. I think he went over to the left. Yeah, he went behind us. He's very fast. I saw some barrels over here. We uh, definitely need them just in case they're more ammo. Some rifle ammo as well.
Yeah, I don't know what this guy is. There he is. Oh boy. Oh, that's uh, that's literally one to kill. Okay. I was not expecting him to like continuously creep up against me. That's actually super. I was not expected. And so. Leave me out of your crappy script. All right, constantly moving. Okay, interesting. I think there was like some kind of like a landmine in front of me. Oh, did these things blow up? Can I blow these up? Yeah, I can. We want to make sure that we stay away from that thing so we don't get... We are just getting... He's spitting the shit on us. What is that, that black shit that he keeps on spewing on us? It's not really doing any damage. Oh, there he is. We are rotating over to this side. Try and get more ammo. Try getting a few bit more of that black shit. Yep. Yeah, he just tried to grab us. But as long as we space him using this column, there's no way that he could actually get us. You're not so bad yourself for a moldy son of a bitch. I will see, but I do wonder how long that wit of yours will last. Entertain my curiosity. That actually did a lot more. I did a lot more damage than before. Holy hell. Okay. We had more rifle ammo, that'd be really nice. What is he doing? What is that? Is that a new attack? Oh! How did that not get us? Interesting. Okay. I thought we did pretty well as far as surviving. 
Oh, I probably should have read that about the acid spray. Cause I re that's one thing that I actually don't understand that it keeps on using. And so I have to. Leave me out of your crappy script. Okay, he's actually spitting those black globs. Those are indeed landmines. How do I actually punish that? Hmm. I think he's over there. Oh dear, I just realized I haven't said the cast of this play. For you, oh yes, you shall play the role of my brother. Does he come back down? He does. So he like sprays up and then he sprays down as well on the way back. I mean, there's a very small window in which you can actually get a shot off. It's not impossible. You're not so bad yourself for a moldy son of a bitch. Oh, God. I was a little to the left that shot. Okay, he's trying to juke us. There he goes. Yep, there it is. So I'm guessing the purpose of that spray is to really like corrode away your body armor if you do have it. If you don't have body armor, then it does like a set amount of damage. I can see him. Knocked him down. Let's see if we can approach. We can't approach with the knife. Is he attacking horizontally right there? Yeah, so as long as we zone him out using this column, it's actually really difficult for the boss to actually, like, make contact with you. You just have to be, like, really uh, present or really vigilant about where the boss is located in proximity to the column. 
But if you do that, then I don't, uh, I don't necessarily see this boss as being very difficult. Except, of course, that happens. Right, what's up, dude? Uh, we've actually, this is our second uh, try on the boss right now. I've lost sight of, yeah, there he is, okay. Lost sight of him for a second. But this is our second try on the boss. Um, we're actually doing pretty good. I'm actually very pleased with this attempt. Oh, he's blowing his, he's blowing his load. I don't know his attacks. It's a very strange attack pattern. Is he just like, okay. He hasn't used that attack yet. That's interesting. I don't, uh, okay. What is going on? Okay, this we can punish. The old still. It's like super mobile. What? We're gonna have to make a trip around. See if there's any ammo that we can pick up. Because we are like super, super low. Might have to try to get a few shots off on him with the bolt thrower. So he's making his rounds around the, uh... Okay, he's behind us. That's not good. We're gonna make our runs now. I don't like not having any handgun ammo. What is he doing? He's right behind us. God fucking damn it. It's annoying as shit. I thought that he like did the stream where he like he went up and then he went back down. I didn't know that he like blew up like right after that. Alright, let's see if we can actually land this rifle right shot. It's our strongest strongest weapon right now. Oh of course we missed. Okay, while he's off doing his... Oh, shit. While he's off doing his thing... Oh, my God. That was actually my bad. You really need ammo, though. We kind of, like, don't have a choice. Is he doing the, the long spray? I think he's doing the long spray. So we have a lot of ammo now. Um, let's actually top ourselves up with this red herb. Combine it. That wasn't that wasn't the right thing at all. Okay. We'll use this first. Oop. By the way. By the way. Wow, okay. What is going on right now? Okay, blow up the big boom. I tried running away. 
I'm not fast enough because my health is a little bit lower, so we're gonna have to top ourselves off. comes out so fast it's actually not giving me a chance to make the corner he's like just punishing us right now there we go blow up man my shots aren't landing on the boss himself over there fuck I destroyed the uh, the stupid landmine like twice it keeps on coming back though we have no more restoratives okay so if we get tapped we're dead there's a green thing up there though try to chance it I'll probably be dead if I go up there Oh my god, are you serious right now? Okay, whatever. That's stupid. Right, if you're still there, man. Like, that battle before you actually get up here completely depleted me of my resources. Completely. So, I have to live. That fight was actually ridiculous. Leave me out of your crappy script. Leave me out of your crappy script. Oh, okay. We don't have any rifle from that pickup this time. Oh god. We're gonna get hit no matter where we go. Okay, this column strategy is really... I mean, it's good, but it takes a very long time, and I'm not a fan of leaving the boss alive longer than they have to be. Blow up, dude. Thanks. It's very interesting how there are just like random ammo drops that are just spawned in throughout the uh, throughout the board. Okay, so he doesn't actually blow up yet. Okay, 
Oh my god. Guard. How did that not hit us? I'm okay with that. Dude, that was so fucking gnarly when he just like goddamn like shot the shit out of him. Yeah, there's more ammo. That's actually crazy. Um, uh, okay. Only two rifle shots though. Oh, he was above us. Interesting. Is that going to become a thing where I have to worry about those those landmines every time every time we walk Be the one saying that to you. What is he supposed to be in this form? God damn it. Oh, that was, uh... Does he actually take damage if you, uh, if you shoot, like, the big mass of Plaga? Or does it ha actually have to be, like, his body? How did that hit me? I'm out of his line of sight. No oh god. Leon moves way too slow.
You don't know you only shot his body, okay. The reason I ask is because, uh, I mean, he's so evasive, he keeps on moving. It's actually difficult to line up a shot. Just fucking casually running. Oh god. Yeah, that hurt. Oh. Well. I was not expecting that. Craft. Let's craft. Oh, we can craft this? Oh, did I not do it right? I don't think I did. He's like a tentacle monster piranha plant. I don't know where he is. Just gonna keep moving. Yeah, I didn't know where he was. Can he actually shoot like through the stone. I, I actually don't know where he is. There he is. Okay. Gonna top off just because that was that was really annoying. Constantly introducing new ways of attacking the entire boss fight. I appreciate that. I'm dead. That is so fucking annoying, dude. Dude, that that one time where he decided to blast and then he decided to come back around after the initial blast. Like, how are you supposed to know these things? The only way that you'll be able to learn them is when you get punished. And I, I guess he just starts doing different things as you progress. I mean, it's probably like based on the amount of damage that the boss has received, I would imagine. That's so fucking stupid. We we actually should have killed this guy like twice. Leave me out of your crappy script. Well then.
You need to fire? Oh, I thought he got downed. What? That comes out so fast. I don't know where he is. He's really far away, and Leon runs super slow. Okay, we have enough time. Let's hang on ammo, run away. Watch your language, my lord. What would others think of you? Watch your language, my lord. That was good damage. So always have to make sure that we know exactly where the boss is because because they should like that do you see that really cheap shot that he just tried pulling oh he charged it too might be able to actually get a rifle shot off over there do something really Hitties, dude. That's how that's how you start losing in this fight by losing track of the boss. The boss just keeps moving around so much. Doing again from above. Oh, that's dangerous. Okay. We're definitely gonna have to try to get a rifle shot because we only have five handgun ammo left. One rifle shot is like the equivalent of like three or four handgun ammo. So, all right, blow up. Oh, I was behind cover. Do the thing. Not that thing. Why don't you do the other thing? There hang oh, there's handgun ammo on the ground. To me, thank you. Is he 
Velvis. That is so fucking stupid. I am literally behind cover. I didn't know if he was actually going to come back around. I did not want to chance it. You going to blow up? Yeah, he's blowing up. Where are you? I think you're there. I'm not sure, though. You're an actual fuck. Okay, we haven't healed. Well, we did heal once. Let's actually top ourselves off. Do not trust this guy. Okay, he's up. He's over there somewhere. Maybe he went down underneath the platform. I don't know. What? That is bullshit, dude. This boss is fucking weird, dude. Actually has mechanics that don't don't have any indicator. Alright, he's doing the thing. Is he coming back around? Can't tell. Let's die. We actually don't have any more rifle ammo left. We have eight shots of handgun. Every time I try running around, I don't find any more that I could use. I'm actually like this this boss is really stupid acid bombs dropped on the ground when explode get too close but they can be destroyed by shooting so does the game actually explain to you the inconsistent tracking behavior of the acid he spews because I mean I would think that I would be able to understand it by now right Wes, what's up, bud? And so, I have delivered. You are not so don't get too carried away. You'll be just seeing us over there. Leave me out of your crappy script. Well, All right. Why don't you show I'm just going to go around and try to loot the area. So those things literally blow up even when you don't walk on them. It's actually really annoying. Oh dear, 
Okay. Stay up there and blow up so I can punish you. So if you stay underneath there, that actually protects you from the blast. Zone this guy out with this uh this structure here. Oh my god. This guy's an actual fucktard. Actual fucktard. Randomly places these blobs of acid around that just conveniently decide to blow up when you're trying to evade this idiot's attacks. That makes so much sense. This guy's so fucking slow, he's probably gonna get back up by the time I get over to him. How are you supposed to evade that? Where is this? 
a green herb. Conveniently placed on the, under his goddamn body. Totally makes sense. makes so much sense. I'm so surprised that I survived as long as I did. I think this is the first enemy in the game that is actually ridiculously fucking broken. Unless there's like some strategy that I'm not understanding. This enemy is like actual trash. So don't get too carried away. You'll be just seeing this over. Leave me out of your crappy script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first class critic is like? Three more actions. Oh, we dodged it. We actually dodged that. Guys, we dodged it. It actually can be dodged. That's so exciting. This, I need ammo. That's so annoying. Like, there's nothing but open space down here. So clearly, if you have to pick up the resources around, I mean, you're pretty much asking to be hit. Leon is so fucking slow, you can't evade. Makes sense. How are you gonna punish me? Okay. Even though I'm literally zoning the boss around the structure, it's actually moving faster than what Leon is able to move. So I can't even use this as like a consistent form of defense. I can't even pick. Oh my god, like literally I'm behind cover and I still got fucking I got I'm actually mad. This fucking stupid ass boss, dude. Excuse me?
Oh my god. Those things are our proximity based, and it doesn't matter how far away you are. You could be like, I think it's, I think it's about two character paces. They'll still detonate. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, God, give me strength. Why do how how do people think of such fucking terrible ideas? We were able to get a pick that time. Jesus Christ. I'm pretty sure that's only been two. So he needs at least one more. Probably probably a total of four. Oh my god. Are you like screaming that shit everywhere? What is going on? This is so stupid. This boss is not even engaging. You literally have to wait for him to come to you. And then his, his attacks are so fucking inconsistent. They hid you behind cover. Just kill me. I'm not dealing with this shit. This is so stupid. I, I really don't fucking care. I actually don't care. Well then, why don't you show me what first class script is like? Do your own actions. sensation, a regular meter. Dance or die, as you desire. Either way suits you wonderfully. Maybe I have to stay in position for when he actually gets near me, so it'll, that'll bait him to attack. I don't know. I tried that, though. I was underneath the fucking structure, dude. Holy fuck. Blow 
up. <laughs> Watch your language, my lord. What are you doing? What would others think of you? This means death. It's Okay, while he's doing that, I can. Oh my god, never mind. Okay, so maybe when he like comes up, I just have to run underneath. That's the only thing I can think of. Because otherwise evading that attack is like so incredibly inconsistent. Just fucking spew shit. You idiot. Why aren't you doing anything? Okay, that's great. Fucking detonate. That makes sense. Do something. Oh, he's... He's splooging. Time to run around at two miles per hour. Oh my god. Boss can actually go suck a dick. Just pick everything up. Mother God. He doesn't drop anything but handgun ammo. Which is beyond annoying. There's a rock that he can go behind. I did not know this. Okay. Still doesn't excuse us for a shit ass aim. So, I actually thought that he was going to come back around, so I didn't want to get punished. I didn't want to pick. Because I thought I was going to get a hit. Oh my god. Dude, how is he not downed? This boss is actually stupid. Just... I shot him so many times. 
just drop. Thank you. Not not even a body shot, by the way. I really hope that other people saw that. I really do. That is that is like the culmination of this fight. What just happened? Inconsistency. This this fight is actual shit. Craft. So that actually makes a lot of sense. I wasn't able to track the monster because he was literally going behind something that I didn't know existed. And blow up. Yeah, I was actually out of your line of sight. I was actually behind cover and I still got clipped. Just kill me. It's completely fine. He's just a gung-ho man. He decides to keep on moving. Where did that come from? That was cute. Up there? Okay. Nice. That was totally deserved. Where'd you go? Oh, that, that's so cute. He's just fucking holding his dick over there. Yep. You, you coming back to the fight, buddy? Whatever. Come here. Oh my god. How did that not kill me? This boss is an actual joke. This boss is an actual joke. Do you see this? Do you see this right now? Okay. Well, since I'm still alive by the good graces of this terrible game design, I might as well look for ammo. Sort of items. I I mean maybe the game feels bad. Maybe the game is like, yeah, we fucked this guy over quite a few times. Maybe we should just give him some heals. Are you gonna blow up? <laughs> Don't have a choice, so I have to use this because I have literally no handgun ammo. more of those black piles of fuck. You can shoot your gun. Oh, 
thought he was just gonna blow up. Okay. Where are you going? You gonna blow up up there? I am so surprised I was able to get away from that nonsense. Yeah, I was bond cover. He's closed. I'm capturing all this fucking nonsense chicanery bullshit on stream. I'm not making this up. This idiot can literally hit you when you're behind cover. And then this fucktard actually gets downed twice when I'm just running around willy dilly, just firing my goddamn pistol. And here I am actually trying to evade his attacks. Oh my god. Leave me out of your crack script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first class script is like? Do your own actions. Oh, two in a row. Okay. What have I done to deserve this grace? I can actually shoot you? No way. What? What did I do to deserve this? Another one? Yeah, I, I know where you are, you stupid fucker. Is he gonna do the thing down here? Whatever. Downed. What the fuck, man? How many shots are you gonna take? Pick up something. There's something over here. All the way over there. Okay. So I guess when he actually like wanders off and goes behind the side tide, you're supposed to use that opportunity to try and like look around the board, see if there's anything that he can pick up. I'm actually convinced that this fucker can't get back up, so we're gonna use this opportunity to pick up shit. I don't know where oh, he's right there. Okay. What would others think of you? This means death. It's long miserable death. You tiny eyes set me up wet. Die, die, die. 
Well, can he actually shoot his shit if I stay right underneath here? I don't think he can. This is probably something else that we should use to our advantage. Good rule of thumb is if you see his body is acid, can AoE hit you? That's stupid. Okay, so he fires the splooge after he fires his beams in this form. I actually can't remember what he can and can't do because this boss is just fucking stupid. He can't reach us here. What? Oh, he's over there. Whatever. So, like, he literally moves into position and then automatically shoots. Automatically. And if you notice, all of the other tells that are telegraphed, that's, there's the audio cue, right? And then there's about a half second delay, maybe a full second, and then he does his attack. When he actually makes a corner around this structure, he makes the sound and the attacks automatically. So fair. So good. broken. This boss fight is actually broken. Are you fucking kidding me? This boss sucks. Okay. Random uh, black blobs everywhere. Makes for a great time. He's still going. Even though I'm underneath the structure, he's still going. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Let's craft. We can't craft any rifle ammo, unfortunately, which really stinks. That would be nice if we could. Take some more handgun, at least.
That's great. He was actually, no. He was right on that fucking staircase. And the next thing you know, he's up in the fucking air. How in the world did he get there? How? There's actually no explanation. Especially when the boss's movement is sequential. He only moves like... It's, it's pretty much like a checkerboard. He has a very determined pattern of movement. He can only go to certain places at certain times. How did he get up there? I'm actually gonna die again because this fucking shit boss fight. Give me some healing items, please. I need some healing items because you're actually like hitting me when you shouldn't be. We picked up more resources. Can we uh can we actually make anything yet? No. Okay. That's cool. This is so stupid. Oh my god. Well, every game has to have one really lame enemy. And I think we found it here. And so... A lot more shit last time. Watch your language, my lord. Oh, God. Can we do it again? No. The other direction. Okay.
Time to blow up. That's so inconsistent. fled because you disappeared. I didn't know where you were. Oh, there you are. Oh. This makes so much sense. Great boss design. If I had a rocket launcher, I would 100% use it on this fucker. Because he... He actually is an enemy that's not even worth wasting any time on. He actually... I don't, I don't know. Right now, I'm thinking he actually takes away from the experience of the game. I'm not, I'm not even kidding. I do not like this fight. This fight is so, so inconsistent. Leave me out of your crappy script. Well then, why don't you show me what a first class critic is like? Do your own actions. What's that? A knight of defiance. Yeah, I am kind of salty right now. I'm not gonna lie. If I if I play it, okay. If I play a game and the game is good the entire time I play it, and then I just run into something that I I can't run away from. I can't avoid it. It's actually a scripted sequence in the game, and you have to overcome like the nonsense that that is this boss. That makes me a little salty, I'm not gonna lie. This is so fucking stupid. Oh my god. It's not so bad there is any obvious tell, so he's tricky to deal with. There's 100% a tell. Before he attacks every time, there's an audio cue. There's 100% tell. He's, he's not tricky, he's just inconsistent. And when you're actually down here, like this, this is a wide open area. You actually cannot evade, you run two miles per hour with Leon. So if you actually get stuck and the boss confronts you while you're down in that open area, you can't get away. Why do you think I'm actually hugging the structure? Because that, that's the only thing that Liam can use to defend himself in this situation. This is actually fucking terrible boss design. Like, like a boss, like an idea like this would be cool. If you actually have like even a range of motion from like Gears of War or Uncharted, where you can actually roll, that you can dodge. Something like Dark Souls even. A fucking roll. That would that would be great for a boss like this. But Leon doesn't have 
anything. Nothing. He can run at two miles per hour. I don't know what the fuck the people that were even developing this fight even... What were they thinking? What were they thinking? This, this is actual bad. This is bad. What fucking hit me? This attack is like incredibly inconsistent. Why do I have nothing equipped? Oh my god. Come down. Or not. I'm so confused. This boss sucks. I hope you saw that. I hope that everyone watching this fucking stream just saw that. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I actually don't care. Just get ready to charge or do something. What? Every time I turn the column, are there just always going to be like piles or blobs of fucking shit? I have to get used to uh, cover not actually working. back to join the fight?
don't know where you are. Okay. Oh, no explosion. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, wow, we did the other thing. You didn't do the thing. Okay, that was fair. The reason that he was able to kill me at the end was because of the proximity mine that he had placed on the ground. That was fair. Every other death I don't agree with, but that one was actually okay. And so... Proximity mines are actually more annoying than the boss. See if he actually gets back up. So he does get back up after a while. Yeah, there was no proximity mine. Watch your language. Oh, it would be so nice if I could roll. Oh, 
Don't quite have a headache from the boss. There have been games that Ares have actually given me a headache. This one has not given me a headache yet, but it's actually getting really close. And so. too far to the right. That's okay, though. Fine. that must be incredibly convenient to have randomly generated blobs like save you like that's that's actually the reason why you decide to do damage to someone not because you actually like like try and like create a constructive plan but because you rely on randomly generated objects the ground to save you this time, you little shit. did that not hit me okay all right i'm just walking through the acidic black fuck
Could you fire your beams, please? Oh, Jesus. Dude, I had so much of a head start on that fucker before he even started moving. Oh, Jesus. Okay. He's dropping fucking shit. I should not have used this if um opportunity to get more resources for the fight. What are you doing, buddy? Oh. More ammo. So the the explosion at the end can still hit you from that vantage point. It's actually good to know. Oh, uh, give me strength. Waiting for him to come down so we can try to punish. But he's not wanting to. He's doing the the sperm explosion. like charging the that beam like willy nilly oh no I can't see him so I'm gonna reposition myself underneath this platform because at least that's that is consistent even though the boss decides to like pretty much do whatever Definitely doing beams a lot more. Well, we haven't used that yet. Might as well. Oh, 
but he's right above us. Oh my god, we were actually behind cover, dude. Just fucking die, dude. How is he still alive? It's actually crazy. No thanks, bro. Oh, that, that's actually funny. Not gonna lie. Wow. Okay. So what do I think about this fight? I think they took a completely fine fight. There was nothing wrong with it. And they, they fucked it up. That's what they did. I, I don't know what this is. This is not okay. Lip Rouge. He like, he's literally a tentacle piranha plant. The design team for this guy was like, yeah, let's, let's make him uh, a piranha. And with the theme of, I don't know, tentacle monsters. That's, that's exactly what this is. Okay. Time to lose. Where's the button? Oh my god, we wasted two... Well, I don't know. Actually, we got to Salazar at about 35 minutes into the stream. We wasted two hours on that fucker. I'm not even gonna lie, I don't feel like streaming right now. Krauser. That, that, that fight actually you? ruined my mood. I actually, I don't even want to stream anymore. Are we back underground where we are where I think we're here already is this where Ashley was when we played as her I don't know
There are two of them stuck here. Or maybe it was one rep with two tails. Housekeeper Memo, I failed you, my lord. I was unable to fill your final commandment and keep the boy from the path of wickedness. I caught a glimpse of Master Ramon's evil temperament during his younger years when he discovered a servant and mocked him by uttering Pol Polgarcito behind his back. He summoned her to his private chambers. After forcing her to kneel before him, Ramon doused her face with a vial of vitriol he pulled out of his pocket. The young master watched with glee when the servant writhed in agony as the skin melted from her face. His twisted grin still haunts my dreams to this very day. As time passed, Ramon's treachery only deepened, and that infernal cult soon learned that they could prey upon his vulnerable heart, curse the fiends. They manipulated Master Ramon and turned him into their puppet. Worst of all, they managed to use him to unleash Las Plagas that the Salazar family has fought so long and hard to keep sealed away. Lord Diego, rest assured, I intend to watch over Master Ramon until the very end, whatever fate may befall us. As a faithful servant of the Salazar family since birth, it is my duty and my penance to you. Well, I don't know what this is. Paul Garcito, I wonder what that means. In that boss fight, uh, he called us Polgarcito. Perfect. Won't have to swim after all. Is there going to be some kind of like quick time event that we have to do to actually ride the boat? Okay. Yeah, two hours and 30 minutes it took us. 80% accuracy. We died 16 times. This was the most that we've died out of the entire game. Easily. What a fucking shitty... That was... That was... That was a shitty boss. That was such a bad boss. something to say I have something to ask you but I don't think I'll get a straight answer Raccoon City you know after the incident the world changed you try to save one person a hundred others die I guess I changed too <laughs> you Leon S. Kennedy. You haven't changed. You just think you have. So here's my question. Have you changed, Ada? Who cares? Or are you just trying to use me again? What do you think? We're here. Don't think too hard, handsome. Nothing quite like an oriental grappling hook. The story of my life. Oh, do I have to go up this way? Okay. Still lifeless as before. Just how I like him.
We have no ammo. What? I'm guessing that's not a good idea. So let's go around. Expelled by the militant wicked, we find ourselves in exile. Withered is the grass, barren are the trees, we wait in expiation. This isolated island, our purgatory. Yet despair not, brothers and sisters, our time shall come. Hester Sadler. Where's the big one? There we go. Okay, nothing. If we shoot that, does anything come of it? No? Some new ways, stranger. Oh, okay. Oh, that's the type right. Welcome. I've got something new for you. Lip Rouge, a finely crafted brass case oh, containing rouge. Anything. Nice. Sell that. I got some velvet blues to sell as well. Didn't pick up any more gemstones, unfortunately. Killer Seven. That's what it was called. Why not try your hand? Penetration power it has. Stranger. Fifteen twenty. Life. Could have swore that we got a case upgrade that was oh that was eight by thirteen. This is not my thirteen. We have to save our money. We actually don't have enough. That's about all I can do for this weapon. Dude, you need uh, money and a no, ticket? Never mind. To get the exclusive? Holy hell. Knife needs care every once in a while. That's actually not worth it, it at all. That was that was an inter that was a terrible investment. Good is new. Come back any time. Well, the only thing we have is handgun ammo, so looks like we're going to have to use that. Try and like sneak around as much as we possibly can. Can we assassinate like by vaulting? It'd be cool if you could actually like grab him over the the windowsill. <laughs> That'd be a nice touch. That guy's an electric weapon. Nothing like finding eight hundred dollars inside of a box. Uh, 
Is that this game's rendition of a Gatling gun? That's actually crazy looking. I tried actually shifting the position of the machine gun because I was like, yeah, if I do that, it's probably going to be beneficial for me, but uh, it didn't actually do anything when I shot that man repeatedly in the face. We should probably be, yeah. Let's actually be smart. Let's be smart and wait for this guy to come back. Pretty sure that the uh, guy with the electric thing actually like routed over my direction initially. <laughs> Doesn't seem like he wants to do that anymore, though. Maybe we can go that way. But there's a barrel. Where's the spotlight?
That's cool. So you can go this right? There are more than one like crazy machine gun boy. So these things uh, take friendly fire. That's good to know. Machine gun man. Why did it still have the indicator above his head that I could further damage him? Alright, that's fine. Actually, see. Damn it. What? Who is seeing me? Oh, my God. Who is seeing me? Where did you people come from? The machine gun guy can still like jump up. He doesn't have to. He doesn't have to climb up the ladder. That'd be pretty cool. It's good. Where is this thing? Oh, we're stuck. 
Okay. No one's pushing us if we go this way? This is strange. Okay. What? Yeah, dude, if you actually stay over here, then the game actually de aggroes all the enemies that were trying to find you. This is like super weird. What the hell? Okay. Can't see the other spotlight from here, so we have to go up the ladder. Hopefully not get spotted. I actually wonder, maybe it was that guy up there that saw us last time? I don't know. Mother of God. Insect guys up there. Yeah, we're dead. Okay, let's uh, restart this chapter. I don't have time for this.
aquí no sales. Te atraparemos. Just like run up and casually swing your knife. Especially when there's the indicator that you can get a stealth kill. That makes total sense. Okay, let's actually try taking these spotlights out from over here. So there's no way that we can be <coughs> spotted. I don't know where that one Ganado is. Damn it. Dude, I was behind the wall. Alright. Time for the ultimate cheese. Oh, wait a minute. There's a thing blocking now. How did we get here? We just jumped over, right? There we go. The ultimate cheese. Running back to spawn. It seems that the AI cannot deal with that. Do you actually know where I am? What are you gonna do? Yeah, he's not gonna chase. He's just gonna turn around. Okay. I don't know, man. Maybe, maybe because the Salazar fight just put me in such a foul mood. But like, now I'm thinking like, what the fuck is going on with this shit? Yeah. 
¡Te atraparemos! I don't want to take down those spotlights. But every time that I take the spotlights down from the top of that building, I get spotted. So, I've tried to do something else. That guy up top saw us. There's actually no way to get the guy up top unless you change the direction of this machine gun. But if we come all the way up here, interesting. So now it seems to be operating a little bit differently than it did in the past. Shoot us when we go up a ladder. That's nice. If we go over here, we should be able to reset the aggro. It's not, uh, it doesn't seem to be working this time. Set. This took a, a few minutes. That guy was a nerd. Oh, it's the big boy.
Is there another gun that we have to move? What a dick. Or do we have to like go back around to the beginning? I don't know. I cannot always like way over there, so should not spot us. Okay, drop back down. Let's go back here and see if there's anyone else that's approaching. There is someone else. Okay. It's a good thing that we came here. You going upstairs? Oh my god. So we turn this gun. There shouldn't be anyone else that can spot us, at least that I've seen. So let's go over here and let's loot this. Now the next thing that we have to do is we have to take a left here. We have to go up the ladder on this building. There should be another gun auto that we have to take out. Besides him, who else is left? Seems to be another spotlight. That guy can see us. Real quick, or not? There is something in here. Hit the uh, breakable crate button. Well, 
You can actually run completely through it. Oh, they follow. We almost completed climbing that ladder and we were yanked down from down yonder by the crazy snake dickhead. Oh wow, it starts this right here. Are we de aggroed? Yeah, we are. Where are we? Yeah, we're not de aggroed. It's a bad spot. Oh, all the people that we already assassinated are conveniently back alive. No, they're dead still. At least their bodies are still here. It's cute. Beast, man. That idiot up there. Let's actually uh, try and stay alive, huh? I think that's important. like has indefinite bullets oh my god Not bad, right? didn't we already kill this machine gun guy how is he still alive
Okay. Where is Machine Gun Boy? Where is he and why didn't he drop something of crazy value? This is the last time that we shot him right here. Machine Gun Boy died. Machine Gun Boy is dead. Okay. I don't, uh, I didn't see anything that was of import. Can we jump through that window? Can we go in here at all? No? Okay. That's cool. It'd be nice if you can actually get that guy's, like, grappling gun. Uh, okay. Out of the way. Oh god. You're serious. I'm, uh, I'm just a man, and I'm gonna take a whole fuck ton of shots, and I'm not gonna die. That's that's my game plan. Okay, the people behind us are still alive. Sorry, must have slipped. Oh. Machine Gun Man is still behind. Bobbin and weaving. Bobbin and weaving. Rifle ammo. Okay, we actually need that. This guy is just alone in a corner by himself. Okay. What's here? Nothing? Well, it looks like this area is definitely meant to have a fight. There's a lamp or a lantern hanging down there. I wonder if this will actually blow up this path. Let's give it a try. It actually did. That's pretty cool. The golden links. I'm 
wonder if that actually alerted anyone. Did. I think we actually like kicked it over too late. Maybe. I shot him in the foot like three fucking times, dude. I still hear someone. I'm actually kind of wondering why they didn't all charge me if there were multiple people here. Uh, what is this? Hand grenade? Where is this coming from? A rocket launcher? A rocket launcher. Why is this guy not dying? Okay. Oh, uh, let's move, shall we? I think moving is a fine idea. Let's do that. That's cheap. No one likes cheapness. You know, you should probably reload if you run out of ammo. I just like loaded the fact that you can't pull the trigger under a gun. Just a suggestion. I'd actually make you more optimal at whatever it is you decide to do pertaining to firing guns. strength. Actually, I can combine these and I can take this. I jump down? Thanks. Oh, there's a lantern there as well. So, in the original, every time that you dropped a lantern, even if you dropped it on the enemy, it actually did like a lot of damage. But in the remake, it really seems like you have to drop the lantern down before the enemies approach it and it doesn't really do anything. It actually only does something if they stand in the fire a long enough time for it to actually light them. Unless I'm just consistently missing every time that I shoot a lantern to try and drop on enemies.
This is where they're keeping Ashley? <sighs> yeah, why are they keeping her in like such a gloomy area? On an island that you need to get to by a boat. It's very weird. Oh, we finally got some rifle ammo. Cool. All right, looking around, I don't see any environmental hazards that we can actually use. There's a guy with a rocket launcher, though. We definitely want to be mindful of that. Uh, it doesn't actually look like I can use stealth. So I'm going to try to pick right now. And here they are. Alright, charge me again, buddy. Not you. Save. Oh my god, I'm stuck. That was nice. Pretty much eliminated our body armor there because we got wombo combo between those two guys, but that's okay. That's fine. We're gonna keep on going. Interesting. Hey, Reich. I mean, he, he was not hard at all. The game literally made it so you had to do a very specific sequence of... Like, your pattern had to be... I mean, there was no deviation. There was, there was actually only one way to win. That's it. Boss was not hard. That boss... Let me, let me tell you, I started this stream, I started at around 35 minutes into the stream when I had to fight him. I, I spent two fucking hours on that boss. That boss completely ruined my mood. I don't even want to stream right now. I'm going to be honest. I do not want to stream. I'm streaming just because I want to finish the game. I like the game. I like the original. I did like the remake until I fought that fucking thing. Really don't know how I feel about that. That boss... I'm happy that the, the dev team actually took some creative liberties to try and include some new content that's not exactly the same. Doesn't look like I but, uh... Wow. I need to find another way. They really fucked that boss up. I, I'm not gonna mince my words. They really fucked that boss up. Yeah, that, uh, that shouldn't be the case, actually. Because the island, you should be able to finish in, like, a six-hour segment of time. But I don't know what other implementations they decided to add. There's one of those one-up toys, though. I want to see where it is. Actually, yeah. Oh, there it is. There.
Sounds like there's another bomb somewhere. because I'm super low on life. <laughs> Fucking legs of steel, bro. Are you are you serious right now? was after I pounded the living shit out of that guy's leg. My god. Okay. Okay. There's the ladder. I probably should have stuck the ladder. I'm asleep, Leon. Shit. I'm useless, Leon. Let me guess, we have to... What? Can't block that. Thought he was gonna use his fucking uh, thing where he spins to win. Oh, this is better. Can we actually get some kind of melee off on this guy, too? We can. That's an instant kill? I did not know this. I'm pretty sure that I completely broke our knife, though. We need a key card. Jammed. What about this door? 
Okay. I am flattered that the game is actually giving me all these healing items. I really am, but uh, I don't need them. So why doesn't the game give me something that I actually do need? And good ammo would be good. guys have have shins of steel oh, I'm just like totally missing I thought that I was actually connecting because the game was making that like splooge sound whenever you hit like a, a meat bag but it was the meat bag that was already on the ground not bad, right? Shit. I don't have a knife at all. Definitely need another merchant to see if I can repair this thing. Okay, I think this is where we're supposed to go. I want to go check out this way as well. A velvet blue? No, another knife. Very cool. We crawl under there? I don't think so. Wait, is there like a briefcase? No. Nothing quite like finding $900 in the corner of a grimy kitchen. I'm just waiting for someone to pop out of me. Actually, you know what? That's a really good point. I have not ran into a, a regenerator yet. Judging by this kitchen setting, we might actually just do that. I totally forget. Oh my god. Okay, before I was so rudely interrupted, I totally forget when exactly the game makes you face off against the regenerators. I think it's I think it's relatively soon though. I actually made me lose my bearing. The black bass. Nice. Hello, stranger. Hello. Welcome. What can I interest you in? So the exclusives in this game are actually ridiculous because not only do you have to spend it in a crazy amount of money, but you also need to buy one of those tickets and those tickets are 30 spinels. Incredibly expensive just to get the exclusive. I think we can we can outfit the golden links actually. A deal well pleasant.
Come on. So that for some cash. Welding. What can I do you for? <laughs> Thank you. Why not try your hand at a new gun? Just give that the care it deserves, mate. Try that on for size. See, look how expensive this shit is, dude. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skill, friend. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Sad to say that's the end of the road for that weapon. My god. Packs a punch. <laughs> Enough for most. Oh. I I really hope that there's another way that we can get these tickets. Because well, right now the only way that I know to get these tickets is actually from this guy. We need 30 spinels to do What's so. That? How that's have we procured crazy. these curiosities? Oh. <laughs> Bacon, what's up, dude? K-Hog. How are you, man? My bro, I just had an absolutely terrible experience against a boss previously. Do you remember Salazar from the first game? Holy well, fuck. What, what they did to that boss in this, I, I'm not sure that I'm time. down with it at all. It took me two hours to beat. And it's not that the boss is actually like really difficult. It's just that it abides by a very specific sequence of patterns. And if you don't do exactly what you're supposed to, you're going to get punished. I do not like fights like that. Good bro, just finish eating and watch some TV with the wife. Oh, that's cool, man. Anything good on TV? What does biffed mean? Oh, the regenerators. Oh, boy. Okay, I need a key card for that as well. Messed up. I didn't mess up at all. What are you talking about? Tiny pathologist Ernesto Munez Reyes. Your keycard application has been approved for the head of the department. Please bring your level one keycard to dissection and follow the procedure on the next page. Overwrite card for level two clearance using the machine located in freezer. Overwrite card for level three clearance using the machine located in incubation. Incubation lab. Please ask each uh, section supervisor for permission to access machines. Been watching The Mandalorian just finish season two. I, uh, I've actually been told that The Mandalorian is a pretty good show, to be completely honest. I've never actually seen any of it, though, because I don't have Disney+. Plus. Rex says, no resources went into that fight with no way to quickly deal damage. That is true. I was completely depleted by resources. That fight before you get to uh, that area that Salazar is where you had to ride the elevator. Like, that area depleted all my fucking resources, dude. Oh my god. Okay, 
Okay, I, I pulled this. I think this went down. There's something on the wall. Gunpowder. Okay, we have quite a bit of rifle ammo. Let's make a flashbang. Mm, and I guess we'll make two flashbangs. And now we'll pick that up. Oh, we can pull this now. I have no idea what I'm doing. Some gnarly regenerator are gonna come out, gonna come at me from the shadows. Is that what's happening? The atmosphere that they actually made for this is really crazy. This is this is good. This is good atmosphere. Might turn around and see one of those fuckers. I'm going places that I've never been before and I don't know what I'm doing. Is there something else? No. It would be pretty cool if you could actually read reports on the wall. Okay. See if we can make room for the aid. Oh, this isn't too bad. Garbodors are no joke, or is it Garadors? What is... What is Garbodors? What do you mean? Are you talking about Pokemon? The claw dudes that are blind. Those things are actually pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what they're called. I have no idea. I always just call them Wolverine dudes. I guess I have to go this way. Insufficient power, calibration required. Oh, I see. It's another puzzle. I thought I thought I was missing like something for some reason. That should do it, right? Oh, all the nodes have to be powered. Oh, this is actually kind of cool. Okay, so that... Okay, the first thing that we have to do is we have to correct this. Make sure that we get power to the outside node. Then we can, like, work our way on the inside power there hmm oh we don't even have power on the outside I thought we already fixed this Interesting. Hmm. 
Okay. I'm not going to lie, that's annoying as fuck. Just when I thought I solved it. Okay, that works. How how exactly is this though? So the mistake I was making was instead of northeast, I was actually supposed to make the top the top component like southeast. Okay. That seems incredibly fucking dumb, but that's fine. Holy shit. Dude, why are people like trying to control these experiments? This is the stupidest shit, dude. These poor sons of bitches. Experiments they doing here. At last I've created new life. I call it Regenerador. So it's not regenerator, it's re Regenerador. Its metallic capac metabolic capacity is incredible. Unless all the parasites residing within the organism are destroyed, its tissues can regenerate indefinitely. Indefinitely, excuse me. Upon examining the body with a biosensor scope, I was able to confirm that the parasites behave like vital organs for the host. Almost as though it has multiple hearts. This new creation of mine is essentially immortal. Surely even Dr. Frankenstein himself would want to shake my hand in admiration. I shared the news of my achievement with that pretentious bastard colleague of mine. His face went white. Then he started scribbling something in his notebook. I thought he'd be impressed. But instead, he actually had the nerve to warn me of the so-called dangers. He's a fool. I have everything under control. The subject went wild and escaped from its cryogenic tank. I was the real food. Well. Level 1 keycard. I completely forgot that we needed a thermogenic scope. Can we go in here? Is this where you have to go? Oh. I actually can't remember where we have to go. I'm not good at stuff like this. Gotta switch the power over. Holy hell. So 
so I can't unlock it. Can I please close the gate? Oh my god. Why is the leg not blowing up? What is going on? Damn, that dude looks like me standing in front of the mirror naked. He's a frumpy fucker, isn't he? Okay, so at least the other one can trail us. Oh, there's another thing here. Maybe we should do this before we actually aggro the uh, other regenerator. That looks fine. That doesn't look fine, actually. get that power, man. That needs to be re readjusted. Ugh. Okay, start back from the outside. That looks fine. That looks fine. But instead of actually giving power from the top, what if we give it from the bottom instead? Okay, like that maybe. Okay. What can we do to make this work? We have that now. This is annoying as all fuck. Okay. Oh God. How about from the top again? The bottom doesn't seem to be working, so maybe the top is the way to go. Well, it can't be left because then we'll block out this node and we have to power it. So it has to be this way. I 
I'm actually thinking that uh, it's the bottom one. It's the bottom one. Either that or maybe I'm looking at this the wrong way. I don't know. That seems to work. Let's try this. So many goddamn puzzles in this game, man. Oh my god. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Well, I have to use the bathroom. I'll be right back. Oh, so we have two active... Reactive. Why is this not powering the node that is connected? Down. This is the issue. But then if we turn this, it's not going to work. My God. Hey. F oh, I can't stand puzzles. Puzzles are actually the bane of society. Actually, no one likes them as well. Hmm. Why does that not... Fast. That explains why you haven't played a Zelda game in 20 years. Do you see exactly what has to be done, Bacon? I mean, that actually does make a lot of sense as to why I haven't played a Zelda game. I don't like stuff like this. I'm not going to lie. I really don't. The only puzzles that I like are puzzles that I purposely engage myself in. How, how did that power the center node? You're a man of action. Thank you. <laughs> it reminds me of like that uh, real man of real men of genius. Commercial. I'm not sure if you remember what I'm talking about. I think it was I think it was like a beer commercial. Real men of genius. Well, everything kind of works if I just have it like that. Oh, hit the one node. Can I just power without the one node? Now it works. Oops, don't want to do that. Yeah, I kind of need to power those outside nodes, though. I think this is the only way for the outside because that's the only one that actually allows the power to go to both the nodes that I need to power. Okay. Things are connected, but they're not powered. The one... Oh my god. Uh... 
Oh my god. There's no way for me to actually power that node unless I change this. And then the other two are not powered. I need to rotate the leftmost component on the field four. That works if I do that. But then everything else doesn't. Oh, good Duke. <laughs> oh my god. How does this not make... Okay. So the power should be able to go from the bottom. Should be able to go up through the curvy bendy thing. Towards the left side of field two. Should be able to go over to the number three. And go down. But it's not... Why? Why, why, why? Some things are connected. Interesting how... Hmm... I am befuddled. I am uh, kerfuddled, befuddled. This is actually terrible. So it's either I get one node that I need or two nodes. Two nodes are in one mode. Can't get them all. There's something that I'm totally missing. I do not like puzzles. Okay, those two. Yeah, it, it can't be this, because if I choose this path, then the upward node cannot get power, no matter what. So it can't be this. It has to be this. Maybe it could be that. Maybe it could be that. Okay, let's try that. There's a very interesting treasure behind there. Why not just look it up if you don't want to waste your time? Careful, you're entering banned territory. 
Right, for some reason, uh, Bacon does not believe in, uh, like, looking up answers to puzzles. He does not believe it. And after giving it some thought, it actually does make some sense. But, uh... I mean, Bacon, you have to understand, the amount of frustration that I'm dealing with from the game itself, compounded with this puzzle bullshit, this is, this is what drives me mad. This is what makes me lose my sense of sanity. Why doesn't this work? Let's see. If I actually ship this, will it work? No, it won't. Because it's not giving power from the top down from number one to number two. So the outside can't be the issue. Reich says, I'll just make another account and say the same thing, Bacon. Pain is just a part of the experience and what separates us from the beast. Isn't this his game? Yes, it is indeed. It does separate us from the beast, though. I'm actually a little bit unnerved as to why this is not working. Why did that turn on? That's connected. So that's the culprit. That's the culprit. I thought that actually would have worked. Not gonna lie. This seems to be legit. I like that. This looks good too. But man, oh man. Ah, oh, I can't power those fuckers. If I turn to the side like this, it doesn't work because that elbow isn't positioned correctly. There it is. Hmm. 
Hmm. Well. this I'm pretty sure that we already tried this but let's do it again It's fascinating. Two of the two of the the pieces on field four are actually useless. Hmm. If that's useless, then that means that I can actually manipulate this. Isn't that connected? Doesn't make any sense why that's not connected. No. Uh, turn this. Oh, uh, why? Oh, okay. I see. Hmm. So coming, coming from the bottom is not the right play. It's not the right play. I think we have to come from the top. With that being said, we have to, we have to change some things. Wait a minute. We just figured it out. Yeah, we had to come from the top. Interesting LE5. A weapon. We need a pretty decent amount of space, don't we? It's a assault rifle that penetrates. No, it's a TMP. It's a submachine gun. A scope can be mounted on top. We send that to storage because we don't have room for it right now. Examine this. Yeah, this isn't classified as a TMP per se. This is actually an assault rifle. I'm not a fan of the TMP. Maybe it will be. Giga Chad. Thank you. Thanks for sticking around while I was uh, trying to finger my asshole getting that that combination. All right, we uh, we shall try once again to shoot this boy in the leg and blow off his limbs. I gotta turn around though. 
Okay. Come on, it's taken so long. I'm kind of, I'm going to be honest, I'm, I'm kind of free balling it right now. I have no idea what I have to do. I'm just going to run right through you fat fuckers. Maybe my map will tell me what I have to do. I have to go to the holding cell, but the... Oh, okay, so this is where I have to go. So I have to take a right. And then uh, not be a fucking idiot. So wasn't I just here? Oh, I just, I just totally, I did something. I did something that I wasn't supposed to do. I'll always support the fingering. Thank you, my friend. I'm actually a little bit perplexed as to why I can't shoot off this, this guy's leg. These enemies will continue to regenerate unless you destroy the parasite inside the body. Do I have to do this over again? I think I might have to. Is there any way for me to check my storage remotely? Did you forget how to parry? Oh, you can parry those things? I didn't know that. I think I have to do this over again, guys. If the door is locked, you need to do it again. Okay. That is fine. At least we know this time that we have to uh, come from the top. So let's actually get these configurations correct. This is correct in the middle. I think that was that was the right way. There we go. That wasn't too bad. All for this. Oop, that's not what I want to do. Send to storage. Okay. Oh, do we, uh, what's this? Oh, how about that? That's actually crazy that there are these regenerators inside these bags. That's really, really messed up. Not gonna lie. Uh, I mean, there's, uh, there's a chance we'll figure out what, what, uh, what we have to do. A security key card used in facility one grants clearance up to level one. Oh, okay. So we have to wait for it to spit out the key card. Shit, again?
Should be done. Oh my god. A level two card. Look at this sense of achievement, a true pro gamer moment. It it is a a nice sense of achievement, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. That's that's not right. That's not right. That, okay, it's locked. Oh, okay. Do we have to actually pull that lever? So I was somewhat correct that I had to do that. Oh, wait a minute. There's something here. Go inside, you, you privy bitch. Oh my god, I needed a key card. Why don't you got to see go guards? That's not fair. I'm just kind of like running through all you idiots. It's not good. Okay. Well, we we stand and we have the fight. If that's what the game wants us to do. first oh the regenerator stopped following us from this distance okay that's good the reason i kept running is because i thought that i was going to be pinned down by those regenerator assholes in the in the flank they are key cards well i mean to be fair i don't i don't dally and uh, to waddle in that nonsense key card game. I believe in hard, actionable steel. Only keys can open my locks. None of this key card mumbo jumbo hippopotamus nonsense. During a recent power outage, a test subject awoke from cryogenic stasis, broke out of its holding tank, and escaped. The subject was contained after 20 hours, leaving 7 dead and 19 wounded. We were unable to recover one of the bodies and a tool from inside it. The cause of this unfortunate incident is the unstable power supply. The outdated generators cannot keep up with our demanding schedule. Management must prioritize the needs of the engineers over those of the researchers to prevent something like this ever happening again. Well. Ooh. A biosensor scope. Ooh, it's a big boy. Takes four different spots. Okay, we'll mix that. There. The biosensor scope can be used with any scope compatible weapon. Nice. That's pretty cool. That takes me back to the old days.
A key entrusted to you by Lewis. Oh, is Lewis's laboratory, uh, labor, laboratory? Is it here? Need a wrench to open that? Is that what? Is that what he said? Okay, so I guess we have to go back and we have to we have to take the fight to the front piece. That's the only thing that I can think of. Because we just got the scope, so maybe that is what we have to do. Ah, uh, there's a uh, quite a bit of rifle ammo around. Interesting that the frumpies didn't follow us. Something went wrong with the game. <laughs> oh my god. I thought I was going to enter into a cutscene or some shit. Yeah, we'll report it. That's fine. What is this? Max out all upgrades for a weapon? How far back is this going to take me? Okay, I'll just save right here. Nice. Probably have to pick up my stuff again. Oh, I had space this time. That's so strange. Okay. Scope. Need a wrench to get this open. Okay, need a wrench to get this open wherever a wrench might be. Hand grenade. I didn't see that last time. So we have to combine green and red, and then this in yellow. Should be another collectible, right? No? thought there were two things. There we go. Oh, there's the box too. Through that door are the frumpies. Man, this thing is controlled by bugs. Come on. Damn. 
How are you supposed to shoot this? How the fuck are you supposed to shoot this dude? Body armor's not looking great. He really wants to make out? Yep. Yeah. Uh, he's, uh, he's a little bit handsy, not gonna lie. He's a handsy fella. I'm actually not a fan that I gotta keep doing this. Take it first, you idiot. And then put that on the, the thingy. Nope, 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 nope. At least take you out for dinner first. Yeah, that's right. You know, it's, it's completely okay to be handsy, but you gotta wine and dine me first. You just can't expect things to happen. You gotta show me that you're invested. You gotta show me that you're willing to give me all the monies. Uh, ooh. That's already a green. Okay. We actually don't have room. How about this? That'll clear up some space. And that. We have to combine. All right, we're good. All right, round two, you fat, frumpy bitch. Allow me to kill you. If only there was like stasis in this game, like from Dead Space or some shit. That make me happy. Ugh. Even this thing is controlled by bugs. Can I do anything? Oh no. Damn it. God damn. Oh. Keeps on waddling around, dude. I can't fucking hit him if he's waddling. All the bugs are back. We got one of them. All for a fucking wrench, man. I hope one of these boys drops the wrench. Oh god. I, oh, I don't have a knife. That makes sense. Oh, he's not gonna proceed down the stairs? I can actually zone this man successfully because he doesn't know how to climb stairs. Nice. Okay, can I use anything to actually make this easier? Maybe a flashbang would be able to keep him in place, but there's only one left, so I should probably just try to tough it out. I 
am I'm amazed. Dude, every one of my shots less than centimeters away from where the target was. He come back. God, freaking dick. This is terrible. I wish I didn't have to walk and could just slither down to my belly. Oh my god. Oh. Stop moving and accept your fate. Oh my god. This is unreal. Why does it keep fucking moving at the last moment? You frumpy fuck. Look at that gelatinous ass. Did you see that shimmy? Holy hell. That was actually nice. That was a nice ass, not gonna lie. Oh, this is open all of a sudden? That's cool. Oh, nothing but the finest ways. We actually have a, a thingy that Every time that we consume a chicken egg, we get full health from it. Uh, this guy was down here previously. For a reason, stranger. <laughs> Welcome. What can I interest you in? That was like watching Dr. Phil Your fight Oprah. Won't do you much good <laughs> <in the grave. laughs> That was pretty good. <laughs> Got a selection of good things <laughs> on sale, stranger. What you see is what I've got. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been insulted so bad. That was such a fucking big burn. That was, that was, that was actually funny. <laughs> That's good work, if I do say so myself. Will that be all come back any time? <sighs> okay, what do we what do we have to do? We have to go over here, a right terminal. Okay. Are we going the right way? Nope. Of course not. Alright, there's probably gonna be another one of those regenerate doors so hopefully this one goes better this way is this way right Oh, the terminal's behind me, actually. Why is this making sense? Why can't I mark things on my map? Why is there no way to see where I'm going?
Okay, so this is the override terminal. It's here. I am so, so confused. Should be like really should be right around here right i went to the other side of the wall from where i was actually standing is the override terminal terminal like on a different floor or some shit it is on a different floor god i'm so fucking dumb okay how do i get down how, how do i get there hmm. how do i get to this floor okay there's a ladder here Power control lever. So this was the right way to go. I thought I needed a wrench. How do I get the wrench? Need a wrench to get this open. Oh my God. I mean, it's in the best way possible. Well, thank you. As long as it's in good spirits. Does the map actually tell me where the, uh, where the wrench is located? I need help. I need to know where the wrench is. Hmm. There's, there's actually quite a bit. Now that the, uh, can we destroy these tanks actually? We can. Fucker. You can't jump over uh, a windowsill, can you? I'm gonna have this chicken egg. Oh, I thought we had a thing that increased the uh, the value of restor res restoration from the chicken eggs. <laughs> that was actually funny. Or when are you guys actually gonna drop the uh the wrench I need? The trumpet sound is actually really funny. I'm not gonna lie. I don't I mean I would want to kill all these, but I don't have enough rifle ammo, dude. I actually don't. I don't have enough. So we're gonna we're gonna have to leave it alone. What's this? Oh, more rifle ammo. 
That's convenient. I am on the search for a wrench. Give me wrench. I mean, the only thing I can think about is actually backtracking. Uh, maybe there's something that we missed. Something that we can pick up. Like a wrench. The gold ingot. Not quite what we need, but uh, I will take it. Is there a wrench shoved in your chest cavity? I need it. I need it to be able to upgrade my key card. Went this way. I am not seeing a wrench that we can pick up. No wrenches. Can't pull that. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. If we turn the power on, are we even going to need a wrench in the first place? If we turn the power on, then the mechanism should actually allow us to access, insert the key card. Another chicken egg. Ooh, you have the stench of battle on you, mate. <laughs> Gosh, this is actually a little bit of a hike. My God. Where the hell am I right now? Yeah. 
I need Ashley to get up there. Okay. I have no idea how I got all the way back here. It's quite impressive, to be honest with you. I need a level three key card to be able to get here. I was actually trying to get back to the basement. It's gotta be around here somewhere, right? I think this is the right way. Oh my god, this place is actually a maze. Take a look. Something's bound to catch your eye. Actually a fucking maze. Oh, we can't go we can't go back here if we have the power on. That's the issue. Ah. Oh. Okay. Do we actually have to kill all the regenerators? Is is that actually a thing? Kill them all and they'll give you the, the wrench you need? The wrench you desire? I already searched all this stuff. Maybe if I just shoot it, I can, like, break whatever lock there is on it. Where is this wrench? We were unable to cover one of the bodies and a tool from inside it. Oh my god. Oh my god. So one of the regenerators actually does have the wrench inside of it. I have I have to kill the regenerators. I, I don't know if I have enough ammo. Oh. I actually don't know. Time for enema. Okay, so let's actually go back here and for the first time in the game, I'm going to have to buy resources from this stupid stranger. Gun rhymes with fun for a welcome. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. He's got three of them. What you see is what I've got. Without the necessary funds, I'm afraid we don't have a deal. Oh, I can only buy one at a time? Better to be over prepared. I don't have any Come space back. for it. Okay. Crafts. Oh, I don't even have the, uh... The gunpowder. I don't have enough gunpowder to make anymore. Oh my god. Well, any time. Mm. 
Dude, I've already been streaming for five hours. I've, like, accomplished, like, nothing this stream. This stream was entirely unproductive. He's slithin'. He's slithin'. Oh, is he going through the door? He is. Are you gonna get up? Thank you. Like, I don't, I really don't understand. I'm actually not even trying to be cheeky. Like, these shots are literally right alongside the target. I mean, maybe they're not, like, directly on the... Oh, my God. Thank you. Jesus fucking shit. Give me the goddamn wrench! That one good. So only one more target. I have two shots. Um, I have a grenade. Maybe I can blow him up, perhaps. Oh, I have the... I have this, but I'm gonna have to swap out the scope. Both take rifle shots. I am such a fucking idiot. I didn't know that you could actually see the motherfucking wrench inside the goddamn body of the stupid shit. Motherfucker. this he's really fucking going fast isn't he how did that Give me the goddamn wrench. Motherfucker. Always the obvious solution. It really is. My god. Here I am holding my dick, trying to walk around, searching everything that I possibly could. What if you don't have enough ammo? What if you actually don't have enough ammo? What are you supposed to do? You, you'd pretty much be soft-locked out of progressing through the story. Oh, wow, I needed a wrench for that. I need a, I need a wrench for that, I really did.
Oh my god, that arm. Okay, we got our key card. It's a fire alarm right here. Oh wow, this is the spot that I accidentally found myself to. Nice, this is exactly where we wanted to go. Ashley. Oh, look at that badonk. Shit. And look at that. Not the hand. Oh my goodness. Leon, you noble and virtuous son of a bitch. You're gonna be okay. Completed chapter 13. Killed two parasites in a regenera door with a single bullet. Nice. Accuracy 80%, even though we missed a whole bunch of fucking times against those regenerators. These uh these chapters are taking a long time. Not gonna die. Not gonna lie. Very impressive with how long these uh, chapters are taking. Twenty plus hours, that's pretty good, I would say. Leon. So I'm late. Oh my Lanta. No. Thank you. You brought the medicine just in time. Can you stand? Where's Luis? He was worried about you. Until the end. Come on, we don't have much time. Let's get rid of these things. For Luis. Oh. 
Ada, come in. There's a lab where we can remove the parasites. Had a crazy hunch that you'd know where it is. Their most important facilities are housed in the sanctuary of the That's correct. Huh. Ada the Encyclopedia. Happy to help. Now you owe me. That's cool how the, the stockings that she's wearing, you could tell that they're a lot more dirty, kind of ripped. It's a nice touch. Captive researchers note, we were imprisoned without warning. One by one, we were taken to the next room. I do not know what happens there. They just took Annabelle. I'm probably next. I've got to think. Need to get my head straight. All who are infected with the plug will be at the mercy of Lord Sadler. If he commands it, they will work themselves to death with a smile on their face. Adversely, the host becomes so single-minded that they're basically useless for any complex task. However, we succeeded in developing the new superior species of Plaga. It has no special variability, but the host's cognitive functions are not diminished. It seems that they uh, plan to administer this new species in the girl. To the girl. It's clearly important that she maintains her intelligence after infection. All tests were uh, successful and plans for mass production are moving forward. The project is a complete success, but I've been imprisoned and preparations to eject me with the superior species are underway in the next room. Annabelle is not herself anymore. The smile has been wiped completely from her face. Writing is the only thing that keeps me sane now. Not that anyone will ever read this. That is sad. We have a crystal ore. Okay, open this as well. The black bears. I could give you a boost. That's what we need to do, actually. Give give you a boost. Be careful. Uh, I'm pretty much a master of unlocking. Oh, hot dog. Hair color blue. And a gold token. Nice. The stranger. If anyone has a moment to spare, would you please turn those blue medallions into a broken mess on the floor? I know that I won't, or it won't bring back the old days, but I can't let this stand. Five spindles destroy all the blue medallions. I've got some new items in stock. <laughs> Come take a Oh dear. Yeah. Oh, there's another uh, target gallery. on sale stranger you get everything looks the same as normal i guarantee it well next time he has nothing new for sale ooh that sells for 14 grand that's not too bad hmm my god we have three elegant crowns and we don't have enough square gemstones. Not even for one of them. That is a shame. We have, uh... 
We have a square gemstone, and we have a circular gemstone for the elegant clock, though. Or the extravagant clock, excuse me. Need to inlay, that's right. That's right. Inlay. Looks like a watermelon. Welcome. A wrench. You can sell it for 500 bucks. That's hilarious. Nope, nope, don't sell that. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. Good as new. Easy work. It's actually crazy. We haven't really been using Your anything other than the handgun hands. and the sniper rifle. I'll see you right. And the uh the knife, surprisingly. Been using the knife quite a bit. Uh, we should probably upgrade the shotgun. There you are, as you wished. This kind of work is about finesse, pleasant travels. I I'm thoroughly impressed with how long this game is. It's like much, much, much longer than what I was expecting. And where's, where's the portrait of tits? Just for good luck. Yep, look at those suckers. Okay. Some of the targets are, well, particularly sturdy. One shot. Three, two, one. Begin. Tell them what you got. Oh, you actually don't have a, a lot of ammo for the whatchamacallit. Oh, that's not good. That sucks. That sucks. That actually would have been good if we had more uh, shotgun ammo. I hope it's not a stipulation where you have to like beat everything. Oh god, that was bad. That was bad too. Sorry, mate. Oops. That's a penalty. Oh. Oh. Very good. Okay. Now we use the shotgun. In 20 shots or less. Okay, so there is a stipulation with how many shots I'm gonna make. That's not good. Oh my god. So we've already used nine, I think. You're an artist, mate. You missed. That's not like you. Double kill. 
Should have been a triple. Oh, God. I think I have to use my pistol a little bit more, especially when those things like start hanging from the ceiling. I think I have to clip like their feet and the uh, the heads of these these guys that are on the ground. What? What? Yeah, you can actually clip their legs with their face, but that is a that was a tough shot. I used 11 shots. That's that's not good.
Well, that time at least we hit all the targets. So that's good. I missed a target. So far, superb shot. That's it. Very good. Double kill. No way, are you for real? Superb shot. It's a bully bonanza. Got it. Holy shit. Okay. Oh. So that S is different than the S that we got on like other challenges. Right? Or maybe that's because we got over 10k. We never got over... Oh, we did go over 10k before. Okay. It finally happened. Alright, so what do we got? With the bold caster? Oh my fucking god. Reload. Maybe I should have attached a mine and shot that thing. Oh my god. Are you serious right now? It's so bad. Yeah, it does work like that. It's kind of cool. Holy shit. And that's the game. All right, so what's what's the stipulation for this? 
This is annoying. Okay. Destroy all pirates. That's all we have to do. We just have to destroy all pirates. Probably could have had it if I did that. Son of a son of a dingus. Never mind. That's annoying. Okay. Well, we, um, I mean, that wasn't bad. That wasn't a bad try. Through the crevice! Oh my god, I couldn't hit those people even if I tried. Dingus, my boy, come sit on Pappy's lap. Yes. It's time to sit on the Pappy lap. I tried. I tried. You could have given me a yes. Oh, that's my. That was my bad. I didn't want to do that. That's not like you. Oh, you dick. Yeah, this is a bad one. This is this is a bad one. But shooting. Start again. So we have to not use a proximity mine right in the beginning. Try and save the mines for as long as possible. God. Oh. Okay, we lost. Man, almost bonus round. Almost bonus round. I didn't know this weapon was so fucking delayed. Sorry, oh my god. What? 
Oh my. For some reason, I thought, like, every time that I use the proximity mine, I'm like, okay, the Volt Caster itself is delayed, so this is also going to be delayed, but it's actually not delayed at all. Stop. Get the fuck away from me. You actual dick. You actual chode. Give it to me. Yes. Alright, last one. Let's see what's up. Ooh, we have a lot of weapons to use. Holy shit. Okay. Wow, this is so steady. This is so steady compared to the other one. Oh, this is penetration power, doesn't it? Holy mother of God. Pretty strong TMT or TMP. This is actually... You can just hold down the button? Yeah, it does have piercing power. I knew it did. Okay, so if we position ourselves in the middle, I think... Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. That one's actually annoying. Pure penetration. Yes. Utter and relentless penetration. Team P is actually pretty nice, not gonna lie.
А. This is insane. Only seventy. I dare say we under three, two, this is actually one, incredibly fun. This is definitely the go. most uh, enjoyable one out of them all so far, I would say. Oh my god. A lot of it is just coming from like memory. Oh my god. What it is exactly that's going to come next? What do you get if you master this? I'm not too sure. I'm just doing this because I did like all the other target masteries. I'm not too sure what you get from this. Ah, oh. got away from me. I reload. Oh, come on. Damn. All right, we got 75 that time. 